Hello everybody, thank you for joining us. Today we're going to do a body posture, which is a twisted uh, pose. So what we're doing is there's like some uh, dynamic, uh, uh, what you call, take on this. So we are doing a sharp curve right there. Now that is the torso. And please use very uh, light strokes because in case you have to change things, you can do it more easily if the strokes are lighter. Head will be somewhere around here, most likely through the, the different options that we're going to explore. So shoulder set right there, so delts and arms probably going which way we will, we will, we will decide. So, and then we have lower body right there and the legs so there's a few things that we can do if you get that frame in so really just some shapes put together and if you can get that frame in we can get cracking on our first pose that we can use from this twisted posture. So this is essentially we're showing the back. So let me just put that detail in. So there's the back. Of course, the the, the composition of the of the muscles and you know that tone is going to vary according to what person you are using what as, as a model to do this so this so one option is right here putting in the calves calf in the chin and I put in the foot right around there and of course now here so what I'm doing right now is putting in the shin so showing it from that angle, let's say that if I want to make it more dynamic, I'm showing the foot like that. And you see that you know it's like a moving sort of action. And with the arms, there's like a whole lot of things you can do in this pose. So right right now, let's say I am doing this. So the, those are the fingers thumb so it's also sort of like a dancing pose right there and of course the head looking that way shown from the back and that's one one use of this of that core frame. Now you could change things around and make it a little more dynamic. Of course, if you want to like bulk up the body type, it's up to you. You want to make it a dancing pose. You want to make it a uh, an action pose. So right here, I'm going to use that same leg, except I'm bringing everything up here, and I'm just going. There with a perspective and placing the foot right there right and accordingly I can also let's say that you know it's like a partly like running pose putting that foot straight down the leg straight down there and with the hands, we can do so much more. So I can pull that hand back, elbow is here. And let's say that I wanna use a closed fist right there. So it's like a dynamic action pose without moving the central frame. You can broaden it as I mentioned, but you do not necessarily need to change much else so that arm let's say is let's say he's like punching 
outward. So that arm is going right there and you can leave the head right where it is. And of course you could also just do that and come right back, elbow, tricep area right there, the triceps and you could show just like this fist placement right there in a curled up perspective pose. So, so many different things that we can do with this and like what's more maintaining that same frame you could just do a squat so foot around here and then some foreshortening and you could show the other foot place there so a squat also works with that twisted frame right so you can have a lot of fun uh, let us have your recommendations and uh, your your comments thank you for watching please do subscribe keep in touch have yourself a wonderful day